Hello ladies and gentlemen, Jim here, and giant fish washed up dead in Japan raise fears of earthquake or tsunami. Now seven of the huge creatures believed to be a portend of disaster discovered on a beach or in nets in one week. Uh, and this has been surfacing this news over the last 24 hours or so here on February 3rd. Giant deep sea fish have been found washed up dead along the coast of Japan. Now, three oar fish. These are oar fish, folks. And uh, there is a picture of an oar fish right there with three guys holding that uh, that beast. Uh, that was courtesy of Chris Fafalius on Twitter. Uh, he's a musician, and they've used his picture here in, or this picture, I should say, in this article. So there you go. You can check him out. Um, these creatures, which can grow to as long as 11 meters, which are th is 36 feet, are believed to be an omen of disaster and have prompted people to fear an earthquake or tsunami could strike. Now, legend has it that they beach themselves before underwater earthquakes or tsunamis. And again, uh, these things are washing up in Japan. They're known as Japan's messenger from the sea god's palace. And again, they are... Uh, believed to be a portend of an earthquake or a tsunami and these things have been washing up so do we have a major event like an earthquake or a tsunami coming to japan now at least 10 were beached in japan in 2010 that was months before the march 2011 earthquake that triggered a giant tsunami that killed almost 19,000 people and wrecked the fukushima nuclear plant um, and you remember that well, I'm sure, however, uh, uh, other uh, people will, will tell you that this is no doubt evidence of a precursor to an earthquake. Uh, a paleontologist, uh, Jason Loxton, says, however, that oarfish are super cool, but they don't predict earthquakes. So, is there a major quake or tsunami coming to Japan? Uh, some believe because of these oarfish washing up dead, that could be the case. Something we will have to be watching for, folks. I will leave you a link. Please subscribe. Hit the red bell icon to get notifications, folks. And please, ladies and gentlemen, check out the link below to my brand new fiction book release, Home, a Wayfarer story, available in Kindle and paperback. I think you'll really like this. You can check it out below. But most importantly of all, do not be given over to the spirit of fear, but instead of the power of love and of a sound mind that comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God bless you.